just about a bit. All right, man, you already know what's going on. It's your boy at Whistle Wavy, man. And we back with another one. You already know. We, uh, <laughs> you've been watching on Instagram at Whistle Wavy, man. You already know, man. Your boy been having a crazy couple of days with the tires, bro. Like, I had an episode I was cooking up for y'all, man. And I ain't gonna lie, bro. I was on the way to the crib to start editing. And my tire went out, bro. Like, and y'all know, bro, like, I, I put it on the story just so y'all see everything when it's happening. So, like, if you really want to tap in with the kid, follow me on Instagram. That's where I'm the most active, you know what I'm saying? You're going to see a lot more on IG because, like, that's where I really post. And I do a lot of my business and stuff. But, um, hold on, I'm trying to get to this trunk for y'all. Dang, I don't know, forgot where the little button is. Oh, I'm tripping this in the middle. I'm used to it uh, popping the trunk on the charge. But nah, so. Oh, actually, I took it out. I forgot. All right, so hold on. Let me let me step back real quick. So, hold on. Wait, before we get into any of that, man, you already know what you need to do. Like, comment, share, and subscribe, man. And hit that bell, bro, because y'all not really tapped in, man. And I need y'all to tap in, you know what I'm saying? Because all the support y'all show, it go a long way, and I can't do this without y'all. So before we get into this banger, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead and roll that intro. Uh, I got the 20s back on here, man. So I'll, <laughs> I was going to show y'all, man. It, and it's crazy how the how the, the videos and everything been set up, bro. Because stuff just been happening so fast, bro. Like, uh, okay, step back. I was supposed to show y'all the one wheel that came off. So I'm, I'm going across the bridge and one wheel popped on me. And it was because I'm pretty sure it was because of that iron wire that was in there. So I'm going to put all that in the video so y'all can see everything. This about a bitch. Man. It's whatever though. You know what I'm saying? It's whatever. We still finna turn up today. I don't give a fuck. It's a nice ass day, shit. At least it's nice out, you know what I'm saying? And we still clean, even on the side of the road, you know what I'm saying? Sick. Man. Bruh. What? That's gotta be the inner liner of that tire or something, bro. Damn. Fast forward to yesterday. You know what I'm saying? This is back to back, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is back to back. So y'all know I got two sets of wheels. You know what I'm saying? So y'all y'all can see them over in the corner. I got the 24s. Then I got the 20s over here. Shout out to my peoples over at Vicar. I really shout out to my homegirl, Kat. And my peoples over at Vicar. Kat really linked me in with these, man. Forever thankful. And I'm gonna always show love to the people who take care of me. You know what I'm saying? But... Um, we got both sets, man. So we got our 24s over here. You can see all the 24s are off now, man. So I was going to have just the front where I was running. So I didn't lose, you know what I'm saying, all my performance. I would keep those in the back. And then I had the 24s up front because <laughs> on this set, the tires in the front were getting a little bald. You feel me? On the 20s. And y'all know I just got through moving. So it was, it was a lot of, um... Man, I don't even know what to call that. Uh, it's a lot of chess, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of mental games I had to play to try and figure out, okay, like, which wheel should I go ahead and get? Which one should I sit back? Because y'all know, bro, I ain't even going to sit up here and purple, y'all. Like, I got all the bread in the world. Because I don't, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not, I'm not one of them, bro, you know what I'm saying? Humble beast, I'm getting it out the mud, you know what I'm saying? Do I got some cheese? Yeah, everybody got some cheese. But am I am I to the point to where I'm about to just go out and blow a bag on some tires? No, I'm not to that point yet. Like, y'all know me because I like to have fun in my car. So it don't make sense to me to drop $500 on, on one tire, you know what I'm saying? When I can get me some good ones, throw them on there and be done with it. So long story short, um, that's what we did with the 24s, man. And the 24s was... I was I probably got the ride then. I wouldn't even say a year, man. And I I, I did buy them used, you know what I'm saying? And I, and I cleaned them up and I got everything together. But long story short, uh, <laughs> we're going we're gonna to have to swap it out, man. So I, I went ahead and y'all probably saw it on Instagram, bro. I didn't put much time. What in the fuck is that? Where are you, cuz? Yeah, 
And that's the other thing I done peeped since I done been down here, boy. The bugs out here is way different. I ain't even told you. And just because Bucko is over here in the garage, we about to go in here and stomp him out real quick. Hold on, what's this? Y'all see how I'm coming. Yeah, it's a good bug stopper. I'm on that live and let live, but you can't come up in the crib. No, sir. Gots to go. He like got some babies in that motherfucker, too. No, sir. Go ahead and take that shower. <laughs> but nah, man. Anyway, so. Um, I'm knocking everything over. But yeah, man, we got the uh the new wheels back on, everything situated. So people been asking me how I got the ride set up. Um, and I'll just go ahead and show y'all, man, because I never really explained this setup. Um, we got 315s, I want to say 35, but I want to just show y'all so y'all know I ain't bullshit. Um, there we go. Yeah, 315. I don't know if you can see that. 315, 35, 20s in the back, and then 305, 30, 20s in the front. So, me personally, I like how that looks. You know what I'm saying? I didn't want to, I didn't want to lower the car because I always knew I was gonna put the 24s on there. So lowering the car, it didn't make sense to me. And I'm not one of them people who are crazy about wheel gap. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all kill me with that, bro. Like, <clears throat> a lot of people know. Like when I first got into this, when I bought my uh, my Destroyer Grey Challenger, man, I was <laughs> I was letting the people drive me crazy, you know what I'm saying, about the wheel gap, and I lowered it. I lowered the car, hated the ride, bro. Like, and I'm, oh, you can get air ride, blah, blah. I don't care, bro. I'm not trying to do all of that just so somebody can say, oh, there's, there's no wheel gap. I don't care, bro. You know what I'm saying? Niggas like me, I'm gonna just get some bigger tires. You know what I'm saying? Like, I would rather have bigger rims with bigger tires because then there's less there's less worry to have to worry about bends and stuff, you know what I'm saying? But y'all be wanting to be on the ground, scraping the ground, tearing the car up. I don't get it. <laughs> you know what I mean? I guess I guess I'm just out of that age range or whatever. I don't know, bro. But anyway, so today, man, a lot of y'all who been here from the jump, bro, y'all already know. Like when we had that accident, or not even an accident, whenever that whatever that was that flipped up under my car, um this was a little second ago, man. Um, but whatever it was that flipped up under my car and knocked my radiator and everything out, I, I haven't, I haven't got my uh, my AC condenser recharged since then. So I basically been driving Ben Serena like she an old school. You know what I'm saying? No AC for probably about a year. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And, I, and it's bad, man. I know it's bad. But like I told y'all, bro, I'm spending so much time focusing on clients and, and everybody else's car that it doesn't really give me a lot of time to focus on my own stuff, which is cool, you know what I'm saying? But I'm, I'm just baby stepping and doing the little things that I want to do. Like, even the gold, like a lot of y'all saw me paint these wheels. The gold on these wheels don't even match the gold that's on here, you know what I'm saying? Because this, this was the very first set of gold. If you've been watching the channel for a minute, this is the first set of gold that we tried. And I liked it at the time, but it doesn't match this. This is my favorite gold out of all the golds I've done. And just to give y'all an update, man, went ahead and redid the interior to match the gold. So the gold on my, on the 24s is the same gold that's on the whole car now, minus the wheels. So we got the, you know what I'm saying, the good gold accents. You feel me? The bent gold door handle. It's dark in here, you can't really see too much, but. It's all good, man, because we about to get on road. Because like I told y'all, man, we finally, finally about to have AC back in the ride, man. I ain't going to keep doing it like an old school. Oh, and then um, a couple of y'all was asking about this, too. So, as you can see, man, this, this paint ain't, it ain't doing what it needs to, you know what I'm saying? We having some issues. It looked like some moisture got caught up under there, which is something that we were aware of. Because, um... We painted the car up north during the winter time. And you know, it, moisture and all of that stuff plays a huge factor when it comes to paint. So um, it's all good, man, because we about to just spray the whole car again. And I finally, I, I think I have the exact color that I want to do. I'm not going to tell y'all. And I, I haven't seen nobody do it. I seen one person get close to it, but it wasn't the same color. And it was on a different car. But 
we not I'm not even I'm not giving y'all no more hints, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm not giving y'all no more hints. If you wanna know, you gotta stay tuned. But anyways, man, back into it. So what we about to do is we about to get on road and we about to get Big Serena's AC, you dig? Hold on, let me I know y'all was we we ain't done one of these in a little second. People been asking. Y'all want the fit check, you know what I'm saying? Hold on. We got the good V-Lone on. You know what I mean? Hold on. Show them the back of the shirt. Yes, sir. The good set of the shorts, you know what I'm saying? With them good land and The land and You know what I'm saying? The land and Come on, man. You know me, man. I'm popping out different. But anyway, man, we about to get on roll. We about to get this AC popping, you know what I'm saying? So y'all stay right there. I had to come over here and show y'all real quick, man. Because a lot of people be asking me, like, man, what are you done did up under the engine bay? I ain't going to show you everything, you know what I'm saying? But can you see it from back? Nah, you can't see it from there. You see, uh, it's a little different, you know what I'm saying? That ain't no, uh, that ain't no black radiator, you know what I'm saying? And then I, I'm a cold starter for y'all too, man. Cause my neighbor, he got the little scatty pack out there. He be thinking he doing something, but I be having to hurt his little feelings every once in a while. I ain't gonna lie, looking at that gold vent with the hair rest, it just everything flows so good, man. It look OEM, you know what I mean? And we got our new tires on here. Good 30. I'm about to slide out, man. So hold on. Ooh, I can't slide nowhere. I ain't even got the key. Giving y'all a cold start, man. I ain't even got the key. I stay doing that because I always be putting my key on the loop of my jeans, bro. So they be on the last pair of pants that I was wearing. Ooh, here it go. You see, oh yeah, these shorts fire too, you know what I'm saying? shit to do over here, bro, like, I don't know, I'm out the way with it.
ever since the little accident when the thing flipped up under there man i ain't had no ac like i put the new i put the new ac condenser in there and then i put the new uh the new radiator in but they uh they changed the freon it's not the the typical i can't remember what the one two three it's not the the typical one two three anymore they switched this to something different and a lot of places they don't uh they don't carry the piece to do it like unless you go to dodge so i called dodge dodge was saying bro it was gonna be like damn near six hundred dollars and they wanted it for they said i had to drop it off in the morning and they'll hopefully have it done by the end of the day i'm like nah you feel me so long story short y'all know me i get the calling around i called up to um ice cold you know what i'm saying they told me just be here in the morning give them like an hour or two and it'll be done you feel me so i'd have been here for two hours well, not even two hours yet almost two hours which is what the lady told me and the, the way back there they working on it, you know what i'm saying so hopefully you know what i mean we get big serena back breathing right because it's hot you know what I'm saying? <laughs> It's extra hot down here because y'all, I was just gonna thug it, bro. Like, cause y'all know we jumping in and out of whips, but nah, I can't, I can't keep doing my baby like that, man. Like, that's the other thing, man. I've been, I and I admit it, bro. I've been half stepping. You feel me on the videos, on the whip. It's just, it's been a lot of stuff going on with life, and it ain't gonna be no excuse. You feel me? It's just what's going on. Like, I'm trying to keep everything productive. It's just difficult when you don't know nobody you know what i'm saying to get the content you know what i'm saying and i know y'all don't want to see big serena all the time but i'm working on getting y'all some different things had a couple things fall through that's the that's the other update man we um it ain't even that nothing fell through man it was just differences in opinions you feel me so sometimes you just gotta you gotta do what's best for you bro. you know what i'm saying like if you if you're in a spot you feel like you're unappreciated you feel me don't stay there for long bro. like I'm, I'm sure everybody that heard the same, you feel me? Like, up or shoot, for real, anybody who knows, like, I could I could take a, a 75 Impala bone metal and I could take it to somebody, you know what I'm saying? One person is going to say it's, it ain't worth nothing. One person, they're going to tell you it's worth about 35 to 7K. Another person, they're going to tell you it's about 30 bands, you know what I'm saying? So, you always go where you value that, you feel me? That's one of the things people got to remember, bro. Life too short to stay somewhere you don't feel like you value. So it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? And it's all love on my end. I don't never hold no hard feelings against nobody, bro. Like, because life too short, you know what I'm saying? Like, I wish I wish the best for everybody. But if it ain't the same, you know what I'm saying? If that energy ain't the same, I got to step. Yes, sir. So I just got the call. Had to pull up real quick. They just hit me and said, big baby is ready. And my bad earlier, man, the video cut out because I uh, <laughs> I ain't had no memory, man. But nah, so we just got here. They got Big Baby out front. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Mm. Extra dirty, but it's all good, man. We finally got that AC going, you know what I'm saying? So long story short, bro, I, um, I can't remember if I had this in the video or not. The first spot we went to, they basically, they couldn't do it. He was saying something about the computer. I, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I think they was on bullshit because I I called dude the week, uh, Friday, and he told me come in Monday. So I get there Monday morning, and he, oh, well, we're, we're backed up. I, I'm like, man, I just drove an hour. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need you to figure something out. You know what I'm saying? So long story short, they get to putting it in. He pulled a car in. Like, I sat there for probably almost two hours, you feel me? Like, and the lady told me it was going to be about two hours. So I'm like, all right, cool. So they they get to pulling the car in. He pulled a car. He got the car back there for probably 20 minutes, bro. You know what I'm saying? 20, 30 minutes. He going to come back. Ah, oh, well, that, that, the computer's not reading. All right, man. So basically, my memory went out on me again, man. I'm shooting everything in 4K, so... It take up a lot more storage, you know what I'm saying? Y'all got to be patient with the kid. I'm learning. I'm growing, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's a lot of new things all at once. But you see, your boy is up to the challenge, man. And get in them comments. Let me know how y'all feeling about that new intro, man. I went through a lot of work. Like I told you, we going through a big rebranding, bro. We um, A lot of y'all know me from the DIY installs. But what I actually started out doing was kind of like reviewing cars and going to car shows and stuff. And I don't want to just be doing car shows, but I want to keep it, you know what I'm saying, car friendly. You know what I mean, I'm going to still be doing the DIYs. It's still going to be for my Mopar fam, but it's going gonna, it's gonna to include everything. You know what I'm saying? Like, we about to we about to rebrand the whole thing, bro. You know what I'm saying? 
because that's what I started out as, Whips with Wavy, and that's what I always wanted it to be, you know what I'm saying, Wavy just my name, so long story short, man, um, we got the AC fixed, you feel me, the AC is fixed, my guy over at, uh, hold on, excuse me, I don't want to say the shop wrong, the first, okay, so the first spot I went to, they was bullshitting, bro, like, I know for a fact, I said that in the video, but he, uh, they let me know at the second spot what he was doing, and uh, my guy's name is Wilder. I'll put his, his information in there. Definitely hit him up if you in um if you in Florida and you need some AC work, man. He know what he doing. Um, but he got me together. He told me they left my fuse out. They didn't vacuum the system. It was a whole bunch of stuff, man. But long story short, Big Serena is all good to go, and she throwing snowballs now, man. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to be able to ride out because y'all know it get up to like 104 out here, and I ain't playing them games, you know what I'm saying? We we had to get that AC fix set, man, you know what I'm saying? But I'm about to get up out of here. I appreciate y'all for rocking out with the kid. And like I always say, man, to support y'all show, it go a long way. So make sure you hit that bell, hit that subscribe, man. Tap in for the kid.